Hello and assalamu alaikum. Hi. I am my subtle sheikh. I'm an author in Islam. And I'm a Sufi and I write books on Sufism such as Ihsan. And we have been talking about the love of God and the beauty of the spirituality of loving God. And how the Sufis and the dervishes, they love you God and they yearn for God and they want to see God even in this world before the next. And God is not limited in time so that we can see him in the hereafter but not in this world. And God is not limited in space so we can, so Prophet Muhammad can see him in the seventh heaven but we can't see him on earth. We have to pray to God and he may answer our prayers. And one of the reasons for the love of God is that he gave us the seeing, the sight, the, t the touch and the taste and the mind so that we are safe in the world. Imagine if we were blind and dumb and crazy and mentally ill, we wouldn't be safe in the world. There would be obstacles everywhere and out of the mercy of God, we, we are in safe hands with, with our sights and with our vision and with our hearing and our, with our taste. And this is one of the bounties and the givings of God and it's one of the reasons why we love God for his mercy for giving us our faculties. Another reason why we love God in Islam and in Sufism is that he is the nourisher. He gave us food, he gave us water, he gave us sustenance. And God gives sustenance to seven billion people, let alone the animals, the insects, the birds and the fishes in the seas. God is a mighty God and God has relieved us of the pain of suffering in thirst and in hunger. I mean, even if we are thirsty for like a few minutes more or a few hours more, we feel the thirst and we feel the hunger and it pains us. And people can die if it, if it remains for a long time. So out of his mercy and out of, out of God's goodness that God mighty and great is he allows us to be in peace and in in mercy and in and in uh, in a good life and to have good life and to have good living and this is one of the reasons why the sufis and people love god and thank you for watching and for listening